41 victories, including 60 knockouts. With victories, including 26 knockouts with one draw. is trying to keep this incredible momentum that he's built up going. To see how Hatton reacts to Alvarez's power shots. Good right hand to the body from Alvarez. Wings your right hand up, hook to the body, right hand from Alvarez, and he faints. Mexican fighters that I've seen in the past. He's not a guy who comes in with is that I don't think he has the power to make Alvarez respect. This campaign mostly at one foot. And he probably can take more than Alvarez can. Well, you like that jab that Alvarez has? He he looks and if he is, they will cause him to tire more in the long run. Yes, he has his games. Good opening round of his 12 rounder. It's a 59. 13 of them power connects, 13 of 35. Alvarez is by the shot. Best shot of the fight for Alvarez so far. Pick and Duck Hunt, um, he's picking shots and just banging them on. You're not going to beat him. Like he needs, that. He needs to be a little Ricky Hatton. So far, I think Matthew Hatton's fighting pretty well under the circumstances, you know. Ooh, good left took to the potty by Alvarez. Uh, thighs, Every, a lot of power base. Everything about him is against the Mexican. Look to the body, does Alvarez. Left hand to the chin, right. Both throw left, Alvarez is hurt more. Oh, good left hook, right hand, left hook. No respect at all for Hatton's power. Alvarez landed 21 of 49 power shots as charted by Compton's power and starts to impose his will on Matthew are stronger and overpowering your opponent. But once you get to that point, so he's just, you're just playing uh, target practice with him. But what's the point? You know, like, the point here is to see how long. <laughs> Left hand from... Oh. <laughs> stop, 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 stop! Oh, of getting hit. He does not run from punches at all. I mean, he tries to cover. Because if he becomes champ tonight, he's going to become a target right away. And he doesn't really care about getting hit. And in pro boxing, that's one thing. I'm three. With an Alvarez right hand. 16 in power connects, according to Comp. Your boxes, we check in with an unofficial ringside. His hands go, it's five, six, seven shots at a time, and he lands most of them. Supposedly, to protect your hands. Now, I don't know if Canelo's got bad hands, but... Nevertheless, puts punches together. And he does have good... By 18. We talk about the recipe for a great action. There are going to be some classic oh, wars that hurt. in his future. That yeah, hurt really a left bad, hand man. to the... Doubles up that left again and a right. Then he goes with a right hook to the body and a right cross. See, right there, he's not protecting himself. Right to the head from Alvarez. He got to work on that defense. Stop, stop. Definitely not as hard of a puncher. Ten seconds. Yes, a little <laughs> See Canelo try to motion the ref out of the way. So he hand, had his hands were up protecting his head. He never saw that body shot coming. That punch caused that cut. The thing you gotta do is you gotta quit letting this kid back him up. Anytime you back up on a kid who's this and smother those powerful shots like that, it would be much better for him. Something. <laughs> and they stopped the fight because of the cut on a clean shot. I mean, I don't see how his brother was really coming at Canelo hard. We found out a lot of 41 and 4, 16 knockouts earlier tonight. Adrian Broner. I mentioned earlier. Good left hand to the body by Alvarez again. He's just That's why he's in the ring with Alvarez. He's just too small. Getting our 15 years of HBO's Boxing After Dark and HBO and getting people excited, and they should be excited about him. He shows you don't have to be the most talented guy in the world to inspire people.
belt. They offered to let him fight for the title, and if I were in his situation. And it should be significant fights. It's not as though the quality of his opposition that for a 20 year old he has to the fans, his promoter is being very careful with him. Oh, Grant, you can see it. See what's good about this guy. Ranks and starts fighting better level of opposition. It's going to create even more interest. Uh, just like Alvarez turned pro at the age of 15 as a face. Not at all. If you look at his attitude right now, his attitude is kill, kill, kill. But attitude is going to reign supreme every time. So you think there's a, a fundamental difference? So I said, here's a guy who's going to be on the top pound for pound this. Not because of his office. Oh. Tempo. We begin round number seven. Yeah. A lot of people are going to criticize me for round four, which I scored 10 to 9. I could have packed. I just beat them up, and he's winning the fight. And it's not as if Hatton doesn't throw back enough. Alvarez. All right, Harold. Alvarez just wearing and wearing and wearing on Hatton. What a combination. Some patience here. You know, he's coming forward. He's throwing and landing. No, he's not. He's being very smart when he's going. <laughs> Grab the fighter by the glove and say one point from this guy. Wow, Alvarez has only been stopped once in his career. Fights back and eats a right hand. Looks like Hatton is well. I think he's going to get it, Roy. <laughs> Here they were tied up. Hatton hit. Hatton threw 33 in the entire round. Hatton's corner, but I feel like they gave him the wrong advice. Punches on the inside as he can. That's the safest thing for him. Or it was the other strategy clearly doesn't. Even if it feels like the... He's getting killed out there. Right, because Alvarez uses that strong jet. See that? See that? See the room is getting with that hook. been able to land the shots really clean when Hatton's in the defensive like a base drum. Around at 150 pounds. Don't hold, don't hold. Ten seconds. Yes, segundo. Alvarez opens up at the end of the eighth. Eddie Mustafa Muhammad may have had the best left hook to the body until this kid. Or on the uh, <laughs> world championship level. Well, I wasn't <laughs> saying in my club totally. I was talking about... <laughs> of course, Joe Frazier and the list goes on. <laughs> Just the... Uh, as many shots as he takes. 30 punches to Alvarez's 16 in this round. Where well, Alvarez is a little tired from... And he knows that will keep Hatton weak. Landed a good left yeah. hook. Beautiful triple left hook. Aim as a biting sow. And of round number nine. Set. Spanned less than three minutes of action. <laughs> That's 120 points. So he took a point. But be as it may, and the panic is out in front. Anyway, eight rounds uh, to nothing. Uh, he's got caught with a lot of good body shots, but he has protected already. It's amazing. At 20 years old. Yeah, this is his 223rd <laughs> round. He's fighting and to already have the resume he has. And then Alvarez hits him off the break <laughs> and a little acting there by Hatton. I love how Alvarez pivots around. And now oh, Alvarez that hurt. Left and right. Comes back at him. And I love the way Hatton came back at Alvarez after that beat him. Beautiful left hook to the jaw. Then yeah, Hatton thinks about Hollywood and goes down <laughs> for a minute. We begin round 11. 0 oh, 1 with 26 knockouts against Matthew Hatton. The hardest. <laughs> which, is, which is why when you get a Manny Pacquiao, you thank your lucky star. Yes, he was. Yeah. Which, Definitely, he turned poor about 15 years old and became. Connect with people the way he's connected. Well, he's totally different in every aspect. You know, he's not. He's definitely an action-packed figure waiting to happen in boxing. 
not just last the distance, but go the distance while fighting. So Alvarez and Matthew Hatton, 12th and final round, 154. I'm right now. <laughs> <laughs> for sure. They're heading very closely now. That's a shot. No. Yeah, I mean, he changed the story of the fight from Ken Alvarez. Good hope, Matt. 10,000 fans. Don't hold, Matt. Don't hold. <laughs> Tempo! <laughs> Lost a punch. Lost a point for hitting Hatton on the... By unanimous decision, Damas y Caballeros.